live in eight minutes' time. But now a, a running fad that started on the Gold Coast two years ago is spreading across the country. It's called Park Run. And as Ashlyn Krukellis discovered, it's had a huge impact on one Queensland family. When it's raining again, You've got to be a pretty keen runner to brave a day like this. It doesn't matter what the weather is, um, we'll always run. Every Saturday without fail even when it's wet, cold and miserable. Do you get a few nerves on the start line? Always. Yeah, I don't know why, because it's not really like it's a big race or anything. Hey! Yep, Tony Jennings is definitely keen, and there's a good reason for it. When I was 43, I had a series of heart attacks and um, ended up in hospital and then had to have a, a double bypass. The reason that I'd lasted so long was that um, the exercise that I did, to put it bluntly, um, running and exercise in general um, saved my life. It turns out most members of Tony's family have similar conditions. It means they all need to be careful when increasing their heart rate. So they exercise to get... From my experience, it's so inclusive. It doesn't matter whether you're running with dog, running with your pram, whether you're um, overweight and really slow or you're an elite runner, everybody's welcome. The races start at 7 o'clock every Saturday morning. They're always five kilometres long and thanks to sponsorship from Adidas, anyone can join in for free. It really is, I guess, community running in its purest form. Parkrun started in Bushy Park in London almost a decade ago. The idea spread across the UK, then the world. There are tracks in Denmark, Poland, South Africa, America, New Zealand, and now 37 here in Australia, where more than 27,000 runners take part every weekend. We encourage people to travel around and see other park runs, both in their city and around the, uh, Australia and around the world. And we call this park run tourism. Uh, as a bit of a joke, but it really is something that we see a lot of with Parkrun. Tony agrees it's the perfect way to discover new places and already calls himself a Parkrun tourist. I've got this idea now that whatever I'm doing in future, wherever I am in, in Australia or, or anywhere in the world if I'm travelling, on a Saturday morning I'll look around and see where the local Parkrun is. Great story, great track in the 80s and the 90s.